to uh, clarify a little more on these clips. I, you know, one of my reluctance, uh, my, my reluctance to have clips on my bike is I'm afraid I'm, I'm, I'm not going to know how to use them and I'm going to fall over. I mean, I, I'm not going to have my foot to be able to put out and stop myself. Yeah, uh, exactly. So. Um, there's, uh, I hate to say this, but there's one rule that most all cyclists will tell you is that if you get clipless pedals, you're going to experience at least one or two falls before you really learn. <laughs> Uh, they're usually yeah. fun things, they're embarrassing, but that's it. But with the trainer, you can avoid that just by practicing on here. You're not going to tip the bike over, that's for sure. And you have, you know, as long as you want to feel comfortable with it before you take it out on the road. So, uh, once again, here we got the answer for that. Uh, Great. You know. And what's the advantage of the clips, Brad? Oh, good question. Uh, first of all, if for uh, serious bicyclers, they estimate you'll be 10% faster with clipless pedals. Okay, and the reason is, is if you just have flat pedals, all you're doing is pushing straight down. You only get power when you push straight down. Because if you pull up on flat pedals, your foot comes off the pedal. You're only using one muscle, you know, one set of muscles, sure. the quads, and the glutes. But when you pull up from this position on this foot, up through here, you can spend a lot of energy with your hamstrings, which are a fairly large muscle group, and that's going to help propel you forward sure. faster. It's going to give you a better workout, and fitness-wise, it's even better. Okay, so you're going to work more muscles. It's more of an even workout for your body, working, you know, eccentric and concentric muscles. It's definitely a better workout, and it's faster. So that's the benefit of the clipless. Uh, one thing I do with my clipless in the wintertime when I'm training, if I take one foot off, I hold it, I put it back here and rest it, and I'll actually train with one leg. Okay. And that forces me to make circles and use those hamstrings. And it's a great workout. I do this for 30 seconds. Wow. And then I switch feet to this one. And while I'm doing that, I'm practicing getting in and out of the clips. So I get sure. better with that as well. So you get a single leg workout, great training. This would be great for rehab for someone with a weak leg from whatever injury. So clipless pedals are great, super way to learn how to use them. You know, now I can easily get in and out. I still got to fill around sometimes with them, but they're, uh, they're great. Have a good time with them. Don't be afraid with it. But if you don't want to deal with it, the flats will work fine. You're going to get a good workout as well. Who carries the clips, Brad? Is that just bike shops pretty much? Mostly bike shops. You can order them through catalogs. But if you're not familiar with them, go to a bike shop, have them explain to you, see what they have. And once you get prices and you know what you want, they go to the catalog. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> or Amazon.com or whatever. That's up to you. There's a lot of ways you can do your shopping. I don't really care. Uh, but uh, that's, uh, that's a good question for that as well. Good.